Ever pondered the secret to brewing the perfect cup of coffee right at home? The answer lies not in fancy machines or expensive beans, but in understanding the simple yet nuanced process that transforms the humble coffee bean into a cup of liquid gold. Start with selecting the right coffee beans. There's a world of flavors to explore, from the fruity notes of Ethiopian beans to the nutty undertones of Colombian varieties. The choice ultimately depends on personal preference. So go ahead, be adventurous and try different beans until you find your perfect match. Next, grind the beans. A great cup of coffee demands freshly ground beans. The size of the grind matters too. A fine grind is perfect for espresso, while a coarse grind works best for French press. For a regular cup of joe, aim for a medium grind. Next comes the art of measurement. For that perfect balance of flavor and intensity, stick to the golden ratio. Two tablespoons of coffee for every six ounces of water. Too much coffee, and it could taste bitter. Too little, and it might be too weak. Now, heat the water. The perfect temperature to extract the best flavors is just off the boil, around 200 degrees Fahrenheit. A simple trick is to let the kettle sit for about 30 seconds after it's boiled. Then it's time for the magic to happen. Combine the hot water and coffee grounds. The key here is patience. Allow the coffee to steep for about 4 minutes. This is the time when the water extracts the rich flavors and delightful aromas from the coffee grounds. Finally, strain and serve. Whether you're using a French press, a pour-over, or a traditional coffee maker, the final step is to separate the liquid from the grounds. And voila, your perfect cup of coffee is ready. So to summarize, the perfect cup of coffee at home involves six simple steps. Selecting the right coffee beans, grinding them to the right size, measuring the right amount, heating the water to the right temperature, steeping for the right amount of time, and finally, straining and serving. Remember the beauty of coffee, lies in its complexity and versatility. With these guidelines, you're well on your way to mastering the art of coffee brewing at home. So, start experimenting, refining, and most importantly, enjoying your perfect cup of coffee. After all, life's too short for bad coffee.